I love Christmas and I love food. And for the past few years, one of my favorite Philly Live traditions has been exploring how different cultures all around the world celebrate the holidays through their cuisine. Today, we are celebrating Venezuelan Christmas at an adorable, sweet, cozy, family-owned restaurant in Armour. I love this story and I hope that you do too. Autana is cooking up authentic Venezuelan food. After he lost his job at the Four Seasons during COVID, Lavi Hernandez wanted to use his skills in the kitchen to bring the delicious flavors of Venezuela to his mainline community. He and his daughter Maria started selling arepas and empanadas for takeout and delivery before opening their own storefront. Now they're serving breakfast, lunch, and dinner across the street from the Ardmore train station. The first day was incredible. People eat and people coming every day. Traditional Christmas dinner in Venezuela is El Plato Navideño, a tasty spread of pork, chicken salad, rolled ham bread, and ayacas. In Venezuela, Christmas without ayacas is not Christmas. <laughs> ayacas are a form of tamal filled with beef, chicken, pork, raisins, and olives. Lavi and Maria wanted to bring the festive flavors to their Philadelphia neighbors, and ayacas have been a huge hit at Autana. I received the, the love of the people, and I make the ayacas with more, more power. Lavi and I are in the kitchen at Autana. We've got some delicious smelling ingredients. Everything smells incredible back here. And Lavi, you're gonna teach me how to make an ayaka. Yeah, Okay. I teach you. Lavi brushes a banana leaf with oil colored by a chote. He places a ball of dough, which is made of cornmeal, in the middle of the leaf and presses it flat. Then it's time to load up on the filling. Well, the sauce looks delicious. There's Pura raisins, mother. there's olives. Pura another? Why yeah. not? It's Christmas. It's Let's Christmas. do another. <laughs> it's a gift. <laughs> As Levy adds garnish and tenderly folds up each ayaka, I can't help but notice the care he puts into every single one. He doesn't even let anyone else on staff make the ayakas. This is really, it's like watching an art form take place. It's really incredible <laughs> to watch. And you make all of these by hand. Yeah. That's a labor of love. These handmade. These are big this is too. Your That's big. This is my present. <laughs> Thank you so much. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> because Levi and his family want everyone to be able to celebrate Christmas with them, they even offer a vegetarian version. Mine was filled with farro, chickpeas, carrots, olives, and raisins. The flavor combination is so good. I love the texture of the cornmeal. You can tell it was made with love too, so thank you. <laughs> Ayacas are a Venezuelan tradition that Lavi and Maria are proud to share with people from every culture. But this holiday season, they hope that their fellow Venezuelans find a little extra comfort in these tasty treats. I hope that people feel like home, okay? And feel the Christmas in Altama. Because the Altana is Venezuela. <laughs> Levi, thank you so much. This has been a really cool and educational and fun experience, and I really appreciate you having us back into your kitchen. Thank you, and Merry Christmas. Feliz Merry Navidad. Merry Christmas. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> <laughs> A huge heartfelt thank you to the whole Hernandez family and to my friend and fellow NBC10 Telemundo 62 reporter Isabel Sanchez. Isa is Venezuelan and she actually introduced me to Autana. We've gone together and I met that wonderful family through her. So thank you to Isa and the family. The food is truly phenomenal any time of year, but these ayacas are awesome. So if you would like to try some ayacas or any of the other delicious food on the holiday menu, Autana is already sold out for Christmas, but you can still play some New Year's orders. We've got a link to do so in the Philly Live section of NBC10.com or the NBC10 app.